more burritos, anyone? Uh, I'll have Come another one, son. What? I didn't know you were such a good cook. Yeah. Thank you. Adrian is a man of many talents. Yeah, well, you know, cooking relaxes me. I picked up the old recipe from the chef over at SOS. Oh, they really are delicious, you know. You can come over and cook for this crew any time you want. Yeah, come over and cook even without the crew. Oh, you know, I'm a fan for it, Ma. This man has taken over your kitchen. Not likely, no, no. You were such a troublemaker. Here, bite this. What? Uh, oh, mm. you didn't take the one off the left-hand side. That's mine. It has habanero peppers on it. No, did I? Ah. Oh! I gotta pick up Colby. Oh, do you still want me to yes, come with yes, you? Yes, you wanna come? Absolutely. You never know what Adam's gonna be up to. So, uh, let, all right, let, I'll go. Let's okay. go, okay? Oh, um, milk! Somebody milk! Hey, bro! Oh, oh, here, 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 here we are. Oh, gee. You know, I've tried to break him of that habit for a million years. I tell you. You okay, baby? Oh. Easy. No, thanks to you. Knock yourself out. <laughs> and you. Are you insane? What is that? What? Hey, I like things hot. <laughs> I don't get it. All right, ready? Oh, yes, yes, thank you. Mm, you want me to go with you? We can stop on the ER. No, <laughs> no, 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 no. <laughs> Dixie's the uh, Adam uh, natural neutralizer. Yeah. Right. Thank you for that. Yeah, well, let me give you a piece of advice. If Adam needs neutralizing, you just shove one of his things down there. <laughs> oh, that's a good idea. You we'll just... see you soon. Okay, but you be careful and... Keep you cool. Right. Don't let Adam get under your skin. Remember, it's your day. Right. I, I won't. Okay. <laughs> okay. Be See you careful. Later. Okay. Ah. All right. Oh. Okay. You gonna drink both of us? Thank you. Thank you. So much. No, I'm fine, really. Okay. I'll get over it. They really are terrific, you know. Uh -huh. You're not... so lucky to have been growing up in their house. I am. Ray? Yeah. Honey, I'm sure your little girl found a good home, too. Boy, I hope so. Pray for that. Listen, I'm tracking down that lead with the help of the research department at Tempo. Huh. Fanny Battle, thanks yeah. for asking. I'll let you know in a few hours. Oh, stop it. You know, for your information, she just might be my daughter, you know. Uh, hey, guys, listen. Um, has anyone heard from Myrtle by any chance? I, I was expecting her here very early this morning. You know what? She was already out of the house when I left this morning. Well, she's probably just running in air. I'm, I'm sure it's fine. Darling, no, 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 no. Tie that a little tight. Please, sweetheart. That's a good boy. That's a good boy. Huh. Listen, Joe, darling, right. didn't... Um, didn't Myrtle say that she was going to be here first thing this morning? Yeah, yeah, she did. But, well, uh, well, she said she'd try, honey. Okay. Something may have come up at the, at the boutique. Oh, well, I hadn't thought of that. No, no, it's because your mind had been racing at 60 well, miles an hour, 100 miles well, an hour. Why don't you come upstairs for a moment, and I'll have you arrested for speeding. No, 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 at the kitchen, darling. The kitchen's the kitchen. fine. <laughs> I finished the dishes. Just, going, I need some help wrapping the wedding presents. Are you telling me you haven't finished that yet? Oh, Joe! Oh, Joe! Oh, oh, Joe. Oh, 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 Joe. Oh, Why don't you jump it? So tell me, what is that all about? Oh, Dad's got a whole bag of tricks when it comes to keeping Mom's feet on the ground. Hey, Rocky, come here for a minute. What? Well, now that we got a minute alone, I want to have a little conversation about Mr. Lyle Wedgwood Esquire and what we intend to do about it. What does that mean? I, we told Wedgwood that we would stop investigating, didn't we? <laughs> what? I lied. <gasps> <gasps> That big a mystery. Had to get the charges dropped somehow. Yeah, well, don't go forgetting that you're dealing with the devil. I mean, really, the guy warned both of you. Yeah, yeah. He dealt yeah, with yeah. worse. Oh, there's uh, there's Merle. Hey, hey, Brooke. Come on in. Hi, everybody. Hi. Did you find out anything? Uh, I did get some info from my research department. Yes. Does that mean you found her? Not exactly. Um, the fa Fanny Battle, the name that you gave me. Right. Uh, was a woman who opened her home years ago to unwed mothers in Elsa, Illinois. Now, the home, the Fanny, Fanny Battle home, was sort of a refuge for these young girls. They could go there, have their babies, and not be ostracized. Elsa, Illinois? Mm hmm The only problem is um, the home closed many years ago. But I, I, I've never been to Elsa, Illinois. I mean, well, how would my baby wind up there? Wait a minute. By chance, did this Fanny Battle home, did they put babies up for adoption there? Yes. I'm sorry. Maybe that's, uh, that's, that's why she was taken here. Put up for adoption. Or so. 
Well, maybe this place was some kind of baby brokering factory. Thank you. Yes. Uh, Adam, we're here to take Colby to the wedding. To the wedding? You, you mean the wedding is... That's happening in a few hours. I've come for my daughter. Don't act so surprised. Give her to me. She's, she's all dressed and, and ready to go, and, uh, Dixie, hi. Her bag is right there if you want to grab that. Certainly, I got it. Um, I put an extra set of clothes in there in case you need it. If I speak to you for just a second, alone, alone. So, Liza, uh, my family and I appreciate you uh, letting us have Colby for the wedding. Well, you don't have to be so formal about it. I mean, any time you've ever wanted to see Colby, I've been cooperative, don't you think? Mm -hmm. I mean, I, I, I don't deny that. Well, why, why don't we just try to keep working it out then? What do you say? Maybe you could just drop the custody suit. I mean, you, you and I, we, we could make this work, don't you think? You know, if, if I thought there was a chance we could work things out, it all pretty much died when I walked through the studio door. Adam was just holding Colby because I needed to speak uh, to the Haley. The reason I'm doing this is to get Colby as far away from Adam as I can. I walk in here, I, I see her in his arm. Jake, please. Look, I, I'm not trying to hurt you, but I have to go through with this. Colby's already caught in the middle. Imagine what's going to happen when she gets older. I, I never want her loyalties torn between me and I Adam. I would never let Adam exploit her that way. That's, that's not a promise you can keep. I'm the one that can keep it. That's why I'm doing this. Why, guys? This is this what you want? It's not what I want. It's not what I want. I'm not trying to punish you, but I have to do this. I'll let the judge decide what's best for Colby. Dixie, you ready? Yeah. Go. Um, I will return her right after the reception, okay? Okay, let's go. Thank you. Why are we all standing around? Would you please get to work? We were going to stop the damn wedding. The um, young girls would stay through their pregnancies and then they would leave once the baby was adopted. Yeah, but did you find out what happened to this place? Did your team tell you? No, only that it closed suddenly. Well, I hope to God it wasn't fire and all the records would be lost. Well, maybe it was legally shut down. I mean, in which case yeah. the records would have been moved by now. God, I can't believe it. Every time I think I'm getting close. You know what? It's not over. Okay, you're right. So, who do we call? Where do we call? Well, I think we should uh, call Elsa, Illinois first yeah. and get a line on the records. Yeah, okay. I'll take that route. Contact City Hall, we'll go from there. Well, maybe we could contact the uh, Department of Youth and Child Services yeah. at oh. the Illinois State Capitol. All right. Yeah. So, it's just not a dead end then? No, no it's I not. Promise. It's just getting warm. <laughs> hey, hey. Hi, darling. Oh, I Hi, heard bro. the bell. Oh. And I thought, yeah, I thought maybe it was Myrtle. I've been waiting for since early this morning. You know what? Why, why don't I call her at the boutique? Has anybody done that yet? Yeah. No? Oh. Where's your phone? It's a uh, uh, cell phone right there on the Okay, yeah. your phone? <clears throat> Mrs. Chance, hi, it's Ray Cummings. I'm, I'm looking for Myrtle. Is she there? Oh, first thing this morning? Close the boutique. Wow, it must have been very important. Right. 
Uh huh. Well, look, if she should call in, you think you could ask her to call me right away? I'm at the Martins. Right. Okay. Okay. Yes. Thanks. Thanks very much. Bye bye. <laughs> okay, so tell me, did Adam make things tough for you guys? No, everything went smoothly. Yeah. Honey, did you see Liza? Yes, uh, we spoke and we have an understanding and that's all that counts. Oh, well, good. You don't have to go into it then, because my friend, in a couple of hours, you're going to get married. You have better things to think about. I completely agree, because tonight I'm going to have a beautiful bride. A gorgeous daughter, and I'll be surrounded by friends and family who love Aww. us very much. Life couldn't get any better. Oh, sweetheart. Mm. Oh, she's so fresh. Isn't she? she really is. She's so yeah, 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 the baby's cute. Will somebody answer the phone? Right, I'll get it. I'll take it in the kitchen. Let's go follow Grandpa. Fun in the kitchen. And I'm going to start the hors d'oeuvre, so we'll have some. Sure. So, listen, did you, uh, did you talk to Myrtle? No. Mrs. Chan said she called in first thing this morning and said she'd be gone all day. Oh, well, you know, she was probably talking about the wedding. I don't know. I just don't think it sounded like that. Listen, I know I'm here, but I'm, I'm not really here. Mm. Would it be terrible if I didn't stay for this wedding? What are you going to do? I'm going to try and find the fastest plane to Elsa, Illinois I can get. I can't sit still here, Brooke. If there are records that will tell me where my daughter is, I have to go and find them. Don't you think it would be a better idea to wait till tomorrow and then someone could go with you? No, I, I, I think it's Go true. with you where? Elsa, um, Illinois? Illinois? Today? I, I, I have to. I mean, if there's the slightest chance that I could find information out about my daughter, don't you think I have to take that? And, and then if I find out that it's a dead end, I need to know that too. Yeah, well, Wedgwood did warn you to back off. I'd hate to think you're gonna walk into trouble. Listen, why don't you wait a few hours and I'll go with you? No. Yeah. Good idea. No, I'm not gonna do that. You know, this is an important family time for you guys. And, and God knows I've, I've made all of you get involved in my problems. I'm going to do this, all right? I'll call you. How's that? I'll call you the minute I land, and I'll let you know everything that's going on. Oh, and, and if Myrtle should call or, or come by, would you let her know what I'm doing? She's been with me every step of the way. So Will you just promise us you'll be careful? I promise, all right? Okay. Do me a favor. Give my apologies to Jake and the family, please. Yeah. They'll understand. Well, okay. Wish me Go luck. Go ahead. Yeah. Good luck. All right. I'll be expecting that call. Me too. <laughs> okay. Bye-bye. Bye-bye. Tad. Tad. Yo. What? Kelsey. Mm -hmm. Oh. He's right here. Hold on. Okay. Bye-bye. I have her. She sends yeah. her love Excellent. to everyone, especially Jillian. Aww. And your love to you. Beloved family and friends, shall we begin?
Marriage is the sacred spiritual journey of two souls forming one perfect union. Today you stand in the presence of God and before these witnesses to pledge your love and your commitment to that union. Brian. I don't, don't want to wait, please. Oh, there's nothing you can do. Are they married? No. Do you, Jillian, take this man, Jake, to be your lawfully wedded husband?